Oh, let's go oh, down to the king Ooh. there, dark side Phil. <laughs> what the hell? I thought this was the low cow podcast. I'm on the wrong show. Oh no! Better, right? That's what I'm gonna work on. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Let's talk about yesterday because, of course, everyone wants me to talk about the big topic, the elephant in the room, the co-op with Kino Casino and Mudahar that didn't happen. All right. So, of course, everyone's bombarding me with questions about what it, what happened. I don't know, all right? Here's what was supposed to happen. You know, Casino, or, you know, talked to Mudahar, arranged for this co-op. I even talked earlier in the week about how Mudahar had apologized to me after I apologized to him about our behavior towards each other previously. And everything seemed good, right? And then all of a sudden, not even 30 minutes before the end of my first stream of Black Myth Wukong, uh, Kino Casino contacted me and said, yeah, uh, sorry, but Mudahar's canceled. And we realize it's last minute and it really sucks. It's kind of devastating because this was supposed to be a big stream for them too, obviously. <clears throat> and they were asking me what I wanted to do. You know, did I want to do the co-op with just them? Did, maybe they could find a fourth guest or did we want to call it off? And basically I was finishing my Black Myth Wukong stream, but I, I answered back quickly and I said, well, here's the deal, okay? Obviously, you know, nothing can be done about it now, Mudahar not being on. Whatever you guys want to do, if you guys want to find a fourth and we can put it together quick and just do it like we had said i'll do that if you want to do a sp just a, a special show where i appear and we hang out and we just talk and do you know what i'm saying about everything going on right now i'm down for that like basically i told them i'm cut my, my night's open i could do whatever you want and they basically said all right let us try to figure it out but fyi you know am i okay doing my own stream if if, they, if we cancel the whole thing and i said yeah i said listen you really think my viewers are going to be upset if I play more of the hot new release? No, of course not. No one's going to be upset by that. I mean, they're upset that the co-op's not happening, but no one's going to say, oh, no, please don't play more of the hot new game that everyone's playing and wants to see, right? So it wasn't a big deal to do the last-minute adjustment. So they said, all right, we're going to try to figure it out. At one point, they actually did think they had found a fourth and we were going to do it. <clears throat> and then during my break for dinner... Sadly, they got back to me and said, yeah, it, it's just, it's too rushed. It's not, it looks like it's not going to happen. And I said, don't worry about it at all. Let's talk about the future. Who knows what happened here? And we'll go from there. All right. And so FYI, when it comes to, for example, doing this co-op with Mudahar in the future, the ball's in his court. I don't know what happened. I personally am not involved. I didn't sp speak with Mudahar about it. So I don't know what happened that made him cancel. If it's something serious, I seriously hope that everything's fine for him and his family. I have no clue what happened at all. You know, there's a million crazy conspiracy theories out there already. Oh, Mudahar was going to snake Phil. Oh, this is all Mudahar's plan to do this to Kino Casino and Phil to begin with. You know what I mean? Like, this is some evil, sinister plot. Uh, no, I don't think there's an evil, sinister plot. Okay, I just don't believe that. Like I said, I tend to give people the benefit of the doubt. <clears throat> and so I don't think that's the case. But of course, everyone rushes to the absolute worst case scenario, most dramatic situation possible. Okay. I actually don't know what happened. I'm not super upset that it got canceled. I have my own content to make without having to do co-op and stuff. I mean, yeah, would it have been an awesome opportunity to reach out and do some kind of co-op with a mainstream YouTuber, someone who actually has issue with me over the years and kind of bury the hatchet and have fun together? Absolutely. I'm sure Mudahar's viewers, of course, would have seen me do stuff with them and maybe, be, you know, wow, Phil's cool. Let's go check him out, right? Might have helped. But what can you do, right? I'm not going to sit here and cry about it. It's not, it's not that big of a deal, okay? So, FYI, I am in talks with Kino Casino about what's next because obviously the co-op didn't work. Could we do the co-op with someone else? Yes, we could. Could I do a show appearance? Yes, I could. So I'm talking with them right now, and I will let you guys know when we have more information. I don't have any further information right now about it, all right? But, you know, again, to my knowledge, no, no one's snaking anyone. There's, there was no setup involved. It wasn't some kind of an evil deal where people were trying to sneak this fill again. I don't understand. Well, okay, I do understand why people think the worst. At the same time, people thought the worst about the appearing on Kino Casino. People thought the worst about the co-op react, and they both happened, and they both went really well, right? If anything, have you not seen the overwhelming positivity, support, and improvements that have hit here as a result. So I don't see why this is such a humongous, uh, <clears throat> awful idea. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
I think a lot of people are just, they're so, I hate to say it, they've been like conditioned to just believe that everything is a grand plot against me because there actually have been so many things that have been grand plots against me. I mean, there were Eastern Europeans who were faking being an online escort, making up an entire story about me paying for them to fly out here and spend time with me. And that went on for months. There was an employee of Comcast, my internet service provider, who was one of my detractors, who was literally going into my cable modem, changing the name of my wireless networks to be ins insults about myself and my family members, and was resetting my modem during live streams. This is documented fact. This is not fantasy or exaggeration. These things happen to me. So I can understand that people would believe that maybe this whole thing is a grand plot against me. I don't really believe that, though, okay? <clears throat> the paranoia is warranted, but I don't think that it's valid. Let's put it that way. I understand why you would be paranoid, but I'm not feeling that way. And if I'm not feeling that way, hopefully you don't feel that way. Hopefully, at least we can all calm down, all right? So, no co-op yesterday. Maybe there will be co-op in the future. I don't know with who. I will talk with the guys at Kino. We'll figure it out. Fair enough? Okay. Shout outs to Dude. Dark Side Phil here. The only detractor channel that I watch is Doody Streams.